Okay, so if you have a WordPress website or blog, you're going to likely need to resize your photos at some point. A really quick and easy way to do that is PicMonkey. So you can go to PicMonkey.com. And what you do is just click on the button to click Edit a Photo. There's two options here, two places you can click it. It doesn't matter where you click. Once you click on that, you can just find your image file and upload it. Another way to do that is if you minimize this, you can actually drag and drop right over onto the edit a photo and it will open up that photo for you to edit. So what you want to do is resize the images that come off your camera to a size that's not huge for your site because it's going to add to your load time. It's going to just be too large in some cases to upload and it's just better to resize them down so you can work with them easier. Sometimes when they come off your camera they're going to be quite large. In the case of this one it's only about 1200. So let me show you how to resize it. The first thing you want to do is click this button right here that says resize. And this image as I mentioned is only about 1200 so it's not too big. But it, sometimes they'll be 3,000, 4,000, 5,000, depending on your camera settings. So to have them in, as a smaller size, you, it's a good idea to size them down. And you can just do that by uh, changing the size here. Make sure the keep proportions is checked so that uh, it sizes down proportionally. So if I unclick this, I'll show you what I mean. Let's say I want uh, this is the, the width to be 500 it's going to make the width 500 but it keeps the height the same and obviously distorts the photo. What I want to do is uh, click cancel now so I can get back to the regular. Click resize again, keep the proportions and go to 500. You can play around with different sizes. The smaller sizes you can actually see what they'll look like. So 500 looks like this, 200 looks like this, 50 looks like this and these are the actual sizes your images are now going to be. You can't see the larger ones, so if I put it at 2,000, it looks the same size as 1,200. So it just depends on what size you get to, but on the screen right now is somewhere around 800, maybe uh, maybe about 7 or 800. So once I get to 600, it gets a little bit smaller. So what you do is you just pick your sizes and then click Apply for a blog or website. If you want a larger one, usually six or seven hundred will fill the width of your blog. Uh, a smaller one that goes off to the side and is left or right aligned is usually about two hundred to three hundred in size. So once you pick your size, you click apply, then you click your save button, and really simply, all you do is have it have a name. You can pick your quality. So small, low quality, medium quality, high quality, they have names for them. Um, and then you click save photo. So real quick and easy, once you get used to it, you save it wherever you like. I'll just save it over the one I already have. Click save and it's saying it already exists. You don't want to usually uh, replace your originals, but I'm just going to in this case. So you might want to call that winter new or winter uh, good, whatever you like. And you can always use keywords in your um, images as well. So if you want to get into that, uh, having your uh, images named with keywords that fit with the image, then that's a good idea as well. So that's it. That's how you resize an image for WordPress or for anything really. Uh, but since I work with WordPress, I get that question quite often and people need to know how to resize their images. PicMonkey is a quick and easy way to do that. There's a lot of other things you can do with the images there to really uh, enhance them and it's all free. There are some paid uh, features here at PicMonkey but you can use the free ones and get a lot done as well. That's it for me. This is Angela Wills from Website Design Mojo. You can come to my site and have a look at the other tips and information and courses that I do offer. So I hope to hear from you. Bye for now.